Thank you very much for everyone for, for turning up today and hearing uh, what's been the most competitive selection that I've had to make this uh, year for the HSBC World 7 Series. The boys have been together for four weeks in training camp. Uh, it probably feels like a really long time for them. They've made a lot of sacrifices, had some very hard training sessions, and uh, I had some very difficult um, conversations with players this morning as I told them that they hadn't after all their efforts managed to make the team. Uh, it's been competitive and the 12 players that I've got representing uh, the Vodafone Fiji Sevens team is a quite outstanding group of players and the strongest team we've had this season. Uh, I've got no doubt they're going to do well in Wellington and Las Vegas. It's uh, number nine for me on my trips to Wellington and the Sevens as a head coach of uh, national side and uh, I'm as excited now for this one as I was for my very first one. Um, we've got pace and power and speed and the team are getting better. The interesting thing from my point of view is that because the boys always just train and play in Fiji, uh, they don't understand the quality that they're, that they're putting on the training field every session. For them it's the norm, they're playing against their friends, they're playing against the people that they're trying to fight for their positions. But as coach, and as management, we can sit back and sometimes uh, just watch the quality that the boys are putting on the field in terms of effort, in terms of skill, in terms of leadership, uh, courage. And um, I've been, uh, I've been, I've been very pleased by the last month's efforts. Uh, and um, I hope the boys listen to me when I say I want them to make sure that for the next two tournaments and the next 12 games they do it all with a smile on their face and they enjoy themselves because there's been a lot of times they haven't smiled in the last four weeks when we've made them run around the field, um, work hard and a Fiji team plays best when they smile, when they've got a skip in their step and when they enjoy themselves and this is a group that can enjoy themselves a lot in the next two tournaments. So in alphabetical order we've got five players that have made a change from the team that played in Port Elizabeth and Dubai. Um, in number one is Mossi Mulavoro returning from injury. Number two, Aisaki Gatonibao. Three, Jasa Veramalua. Four, another one returning from a very long injury, uh, Manuel Langai. Captain, Osea Kalinasau. Number five, number six, returning again from Montpellier, uh, World Sevens Player of the Year, Samasoni Viri Viri. Number seven, Save Ruratha. Number eight, Semi Kunutani. Number nine, uh, Jerry Tuai. Number ten, another making his return to the World Series, Sitaveni Wanga. Number eleven, Fatimo Rahugu. And again, another change, uh, forcing his way into the side on his performances in training, Viliami Mata. Um, again, I'm uh, uh, delighted, excited. Uh, thrilled to take an awesome team to Wellington. Uh, we leave on Monday and I'd like to thank uh, publicly the Uprising Resort for going the extra yard for everything they've done in our preparations, our sponsors Vodafone and Fiji Airways and the rest of the consortium, Saleh and the FIU um, and the management board but again uh, I'd like to thank the boys for, for making my job uh, easier and easier every week as they play better and better. So, Vinaka, luckily.